reporters found in abandoned Navalan store with condoms and syringes in case they were used there by the suspect. It comes just days after police in the city of Chisinau arrested five suspects who allegedly used condoms and syringes in a sex shop. Police seized the drugs, condoms, and syringes from an abandoned shop in the central city of Kanas late Wednesday. Police said the five were found in the same store with a total of 12 condoms and three syringes. The shop is believed to be in the middle of a shopping district, and police say the suspects were in possession of the drugs at around 10 a.m. Thursday in the building next door, the shop owner was able to identify the four men by looking at his license plate and told police they were from Ukraine and were suspected to have bought the drugs, the local newspaper reported on Thursday. The police said that the suspects were in the city of Kanas on a tourist visa. The owner, however, refused to give his name. The suspects were arrested on Thursday. According to an opinion survey, more than 70% of people in Ukraine support the idea of allowing the use of condoms and syringes during sex. Thursday in the building next door, the shop owner was able to identify the four men by looking at his license plate and told police they were from Ukraine and were suspected to have bought the drugs, the local newspaper reported on Thursday. The police said that the suspects were in the city of Kanas on a tourist visa. The owner, however, refused to give his name. The suspects were arrested on Thursday. According to an opinion survey, more than 70% of people in Ukraine support the idea of allowing the use of condoms and syringes during sex. In Doftext, this past weekend, I was invited to speak at the Grow in a Good Way conference, a three day conference that aims to help individuals and organizations grow by improving themselves physically, mentally, and socially, it was the second weekend of the conference, and the theme for the first weekend, what makes a good man? was self-care. I was very excited by the topic of self-care, and decided to speak, the first thing I wanted to say was that I am not in the business of giving advice, only sharing my own experiences. My experience with this topic has been very beneficial and inspiring, however, I do want to share a few things I have learned through my experiences. Point 1, Self-care ISNT All about the work Self-care is all about the work. Self-care is about learning to take care of yourself. Point 2. The work ISNT All that matters the work that matters.